Do you love to use the envelope liners framelits dies to make beautifully coordinated envelope liners for your handmade cards? But do you wish you could get more than four out of a 12 by 12 sheet of designer paper? Watch and learn how to double that! The envelope liners framelits die for the medium envelopes that hold our four and a quarter by five and a half inch cards fits a six by six inch piece of designer series paper. Until now, here's what we're going to do. We're going to take our stamp and trimmer and we're going to cut this right in half. So I'm going to put this at three inches. Welcome to StampingSmiles.com. I'm Shelly Godby, the owner and CEO of Stamping Smiles. And for 13 years, I've been teaching others how to create their own hand stamped smiles. So now what we're going to do is grab a piece of copy paper. And I use 24 pound paper. And we're going to go ahead and adhere this right to it. So I've got some snail adhesive. A little bit in each corner and let's just go ahead and butt this right up to the top and get out our Big Shot. I have my Sizzix Big Shot die cutting machine and magnetic platform. You can use the multi-purpose platform that comes with it but the magnetic platform is preferable because of the metal dies and it just sticks right to them. So I have here a cutting pad and here's the paper that we just cut and then the framelit for the medium framelits die. I'm going to just put this right on here and then our cutting pad right on top. And go ahead and crank this through. And there we have this all cut out. So let me show you how easily this slides into the envelope. Attaching my designer series paper to a full uh, die cut of the envelope liners frameless die lets me just slide this in so easily. Look at that. Perfect. And so I'm just going to put a little drop of adhesive right there and I'm all set. I'll tell you one of my concerns of why I didn't do this earlier was I was worried that you'd be able to see it through there and it wouldn't look attractive just starting, um, you know, it's just stopping abruptly. But with it closed you can't see anything underneath it and the color isn't showing through to the front. So it was the perfect solution to save uh, on designer paper getting twice as much out of one 12 by 12 sheet. You know, if you enjoy getting stamping tips, I highly recommend you subscribe to the Stampers Insider. With the Stampers Insider, I write three exclusive articles for you each month to give you stamping inspiration, information, and ideas. Joining is free and easy. Just go to www.thestampersinsider.com to subscribe now. I'm Shelly Godby, teaching you how to create hand stamp smiles. Thanks for watching.